guys. Okay, I have the wig on, as promised. So, of course, I'm getting ready to do a wish haul. I have all my products and uh, prices and shipping and everything on here ready to go. Now, the light is really playing havoc against this wig because it is pretty shiny. But, um, for what it is going to be, it's, it's going to serve the purpose. Um... No, I did not dye my hair red, and no, I will not dye my hair red. But, um, and this is that plastic choker that we talked about that I would not spend the $5 to buy. Um, it's not horribly comfortable either because it is plastic, kind of rigid. So it's not the, the best quality for $5. But if you could find it for a dollar, dollar shipping, then yeah, I would say go for it. Um... It is pretty, but like I said, I would much rather have had metal and not plastic. Okay, first product we are going to look at is this um, shoulder bag that I got for my mom. Now, I did expect it to be a little bit bigger, but, you know, that's my fault for not looking at the sizing because I'm sure it's on there. But it is really cute. My mom really likes it. It has two compartments that zip close. And there's quite a bit of room in there. And the, the inside of it is a material that I believe that you could wipe it out if you needed to. If something got spilled or whatever. You'd be able to wipe it out. And then it has the smaller pocket at the bottom. So it does have plenty of room. So if she wanted to carry this, I don't think it would be a problem. And of course, it's an owl, so it's her favorite thing. And uh, I don't know if you can tell on camera, but the owl is, the whole bag is like a tapestry material. Um, so that makes it even cuter. And of course, it's going to be nice and durable. And it was $3 with $2 shipping. So, well worth the $5. My mom is going to love it. She, you know, she's already seen it. She knows she's going to love it. I know she's going to love it. I knew she was going to love it when I ordered it. So, that one is a is a, a good one. Okay, my next one is a dragonfly pearl cage. Let me take it out of the bag so you can see it. Now, I was pleasantly surprised with this one. You guys know I we opened those pearls and... I'm excited about having something to carry it. And I found this. And I love my dragonflies. And this one is a lot bigger than I thought it would be. And let me pull one of my pearls out. Let's see. I think this pearl right here will look really good in there. It's like the chromey pink color. Now, I don't have a chain for it yet. I'm going to have to get a chain. But, uh. You take the pearl and you drop it in there and then you close the cage and you can see the pearl in the center of the dragonfly here. I don't know if you can see it. The, the light is really playing havoc today. Let me see if I can turn it down just a little and see if that helps any. But um, the pendant itself is a lot bigger than I thought and I think it's going to look really cute wearing it with the pearl in it. So. Definitely excited about that, and it was free with two dollars shipping. So the, uh, very, it's very well made and put together. So yes, I would recommend getting that that if you want to do a pearl necklace, and I recommend getting the oysters where it has the six to ten pearls in it, rather than the one we're going to talk about next. Because the one I'm going to talk about next, I was not extremely happy about. And I'll tell you why. Okay, I got all of these pearl charms within there. It's supposed to come with pearls. And they, I got them and I thought that they were going to come with a oyster that you could take the pearl out of. And I thought, you know, what great Christmas gifts, right? So I bought quite a few. I bought 14 of them. Thinking that, oh, these are going to be perfect, you know? What a great gift, right? Let me find one where I have it apart and I can show you. Um, this one right here. I had to work at getting these apart. It's a good thing that I know how to use the small tools when working with beading and that because it came in handy for this. 
and I did get my money back for all but four of them because there's four of them and I'll show you for that the cages are great the necklaces are okay but the pearl that came with it is not a pearl it is a bead and if you could if I could get it to focus you'd be able to see you can kind of almost see it right there in the center there's a hole let me see if I can turn it around maybe you can see the other end better but there's a hole which means it's not a pearl at all I don't know if I can get that to focus but it's not a pearl it's a bead so I did take pictures of them and I did get a hold of wish and I told them what my issue was with the, the ones that I got the money back now there's four that there's no holes in them but I can't prove that they're not pearls they could be pearls I don't know I don't know enough about pearls to know if they're real pearls or not but they don't have holes so I can't say hey look pearls don't have holes they're beads so I didn't get my money back on the four but I did get my money back on the rest of them which was really good they didn't um, question it at all. I sent the picture in. I told them that what the issue was, and they did refund all but the four, which I didn't even ask for the refund on the four. They probably would have done those two. But I figured since I couldn't prove that they were not pearls, I wasn't going to hassle them about those four. And I paid $2 a piece on those. Um, they were free with $2 shipping and handling, so I paid $2 a piece on those. But I did get back the money for the one that you could obviously tell were not pearls. Okay, so then I got these ear clasps. Clips. I think they're called clips. But anyway, I got these and I was like very excited when I got them because I thought they were just one. I didn't know that I was getting a set in each and I got them in blue and I got them in silver. And they are just clips. I mean, you can clip these anywhere you want them. Say, I'm going to go out clubbing, which I don't do at my age anymore. But, say I'm feeling a little saucy and I want to look like I have a pierced lip. Clip it on and go. They are a little uncomfortable. They are a little sharp on the ends. But I don't think that that's something that I couldn't fix with just filing them tips down just a little bit. But anyway, I got these. They were free with $2 shipping. And, um, which is even better that you get a set. I thought I was getting one of each. And they hang on good. Ooh, that kind of hurt. You hang on good. Um, but so I actually got them for a dollar a piece because I didn't know I was getting two. So they are, they'll be fun. Um, more than likely I'll use them for ear clips because I like to clip put the clips on my ears. Um, I was looking for one that would fit in here and these probably will work for that. But um, so I got the silver and I got the... So I paid $4 and I got four of them. So pretty, pretty much they were free with $2 shipping and handling. So I pretty much got them for a dollar a piece. I'm not unhappy with these. They're very good quality. The metal's really nice. They they do clip in and hold really well. Um, exactly what I thought I was getting. Now this um, I ordered for my sister's dog. And this is a... Where's that? A uh, small dog flea and tick collar. It was two dollars with a dollar shipping, and um, so I'm curious to see if it's going to fit on the dog. It is adjustable, so we'll have to see exactly. I mean, it's quite a bit adjustable. I don't know if they're going to actually work. It, it doesn't have a funky smell. It smells like a flea collar, like you would buy anywhere else. So flea and tick and it's the ticks that I'm more worried about than the flea aspect of it because I haven't had too much of a problem with fleas this year it's just I worry about my dog when he goes out for you know and gets ticks but this is for my sister's dog because he does like to spend a lot of time out in the backyard 
Okay, then next I got my daughter and I these mascaras. Now I'll go ahead and open mine so I can show you. And the reason I got them, I just thought they were so cute. So even if I don't use them or even if she doesn't use it, um, I thought they'd be really cute sitting on our makeup vanities because they're key cats. So don't really want to open it because I have so many mascaras going at once already. So I'm not going to open it because I don't want another one started. But um, I will give you, they don't smell. I don't smell a smell on them. But if nothing else, they're going to be cute sitting on the makeup vanity. Um, and these were $1 with a dollar shipping. So it's a total of $4 right here. Well worth it, even if it's just to sit and look pretty. Okay, um, I'm going to pause this film, our camera, and we'll... Sorry about that, guys. I am battling a bladder infection, and it just hit me out of nowhere, and I thought, oh, I've got one more thing. I can get through this, and no, my body said no. So, that's taken care of, and... It, feel like, it feels like it's getting better, and I have taken some medicine to help it along, so... I just think I gotta get through this night, and then I should be good. And I'm sorry about that. And the last thing we talked about was the mascaras. And I told you how much they were. And the last thing that we have is these, um... They're magnetic, um, earrings. And my mom does not have pierced ears. And so I thought these would be really good for her so she could wear earrings like the rest of the world um and not have to have the clips and all that and now the magnets are extremely strong let me flip this you take this magnet and you hold it behind your ear where you want your earring to be and then you just set the other one on and look it's on you have an earring and it looks like your ear is pierced and I think that my mom's really going to enjoy these. It was easy to put on. They're easy to take off. You just grab a hold of the magnet in the back and the magnet in the front. And I'll show you how strong these magnets are. I'm going to hold the magnet in my hand. And I'm going to just... And see how it jumped up? Did you see... It did, I don't know if the camera caught it or not. But it just jumps right up to it. I mean... They're going to hold really well, I think, because my mom's not one to sit and play with them. You see how it just jumps up there? Isn't that awesome? Okay, but those are the earrings I got my mom, and now I got her the ones here in, in the clear, and I did order her some in black, and I'm still waiting for the black ones to come in, but I think she's going to have fun with these because she can feel like the rest of the girls and have her earrings, even though... She doesn't have the pierced ears. I mean, even at one point she said, maybe I should just get my ears pierced. And I'm like, why? It's been so long now. Why even bother with that? Um, put yourself through that. If I can get you something that you can wear and you don't have to have the piercings. So that's what I did. And um, those were free with $2 shipping. So well worth it. My mom's going to enjoy them. And, and that's the whole idea behind getting things like that for her. So, you know, she can feel like part of the group and have her earrings to dress up and not have to worry about trying to find clips or converters. Because sometimes those converters for your um, earrings can be tricky to find. Sorry, guys, I didn't know I put it all the way back up. Okay, but that is my wish haul video for today. I hope you guys all enjoyed the wig. Um... I have to wear it Thursday for that wedding. I'm going to be Poison Ivy, like I said. Um, I know Poison Ivy does this weird thing with her hair so that she almost looks like she has horns on top of her head. But I think I'm just going to wear it down. Hopefully it won't be too hot or itchy because um, it is an outside wedding. Um, I noticed that um, you definitely want to put your necklaces or whatever on before you do the wig. The wig really needs to be the last thing. Because it will catch everything that you don't want it to catch. Um, and this one does have the wig cap and everything. So, um, I'm very happy with it. I think it's going to look really good for the, for the wedding. And I'm sure I can find other uses for it after the wedding. 
Um, never know. Might want to dress up one day. We'll see. Okay, guys. That's my video. Um, I hope you guys all enjoyed it. I told you the next time I had a wish haul, I would wear the wig. So, I did. Um, wish me luck that this medicine kicks in quickly so that I can start feeling better. Um, other than that, um, that's my video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you have any questions about anything, you know, just feel free to ask whatever questions you have. Um, I will answer them all. I do not have a problem answering the questions. Um, uh, other than that, I can't think of anything. Um, please like, subscribe, and comment below. And thank you to all 31 subscribers that we have now. I'm very excited. I'm trying to get in with other, uh, YouTubers so that we can, like, support each other. And that's been going pretty well. Um, I am steadily drinking my water, guys. <sighs> Haven't given up on the water. Um, it's a little tricky with the bladder infection because it's like, oh, I don't want to drink the water because I know I'm going to, but I have to drink the water because I really need to go. But, um, so hopefully that medicine will kick in soon and the urgency will go away just a little bit so that maybe I can get a little bit of sleep tonight. Um, but, um... Other than that, that's my video, and I hope you guys all enjoyed it. Um, I think I'm going to do a video, not, not too... I'm tied to one of them all, because it's flying around in here. Um, uh, my daughter-in-law was trying to figure out how I did my nails, and I have a whole box of these. And um, If you guys are interested, let me know, and I'll show you how I did. They're just stickers from the Dollar Tree, but I'll show you how I do them if you want. Um... But that's my video for today. It just keeps getting longer because I'm babbling. So I'm going to stop babbling and get off of here for today. You guys have a wonderful day. Um, this will be up Sunday morning, early Sunday morning. So have a wonderful Sunday. And um, thanks so much for coming along. And we'll see you next time. Bye.